JLG Industries presents How to Start the Compact Crawler. This video is to be used as a supplement to your machine's operation and safety manual. To start the machine, you must turn on the power source using four switches. The first switch is the battery disconnect switch. This controls battery power to all components and must be turned on to operate the machine regardless of power source. You do not need to turn it off unless the machine will be stored for an extended period. The second switch is the combustion engine ignition or lithium battery switch depending on the power source. The combustion engine ignition switch is used to start and operate the combustion engine when the emergency stop switches are pulled out. This switch varies between the Honda gasoline engine, a Hatz diesel engine, and a Perkins diesel engine. The Honda engine also has a pull start in case the starting battery is low on voltage. The combustion engine ignition switch must be turned on to allow operation of the electric motor. The lithium battery switch acts the same as the engine ignition switch but is located on the battery box. The third switch is the emergency stop switch on the ground control station. This switch must be twisted and pulled out to operate the machine from the ground and remote control stations. The key must also be vertical or removed completely. The fourth switch is the emergency stop switch on the remote control station. Twisting and pulling out this switch powers up the remote and allows you to start the desired power source. This concludes how to start the compact crawler. Always refer to your machine's operation and safety manual. For more information, call JLG Ground Support at 877-554-5438.